Edwin, thank you. And as I mentioned a moment ago, that storm system now moving west to east, going to hit that region again, already battering the west at this hour, flooding rain and mudslides in California's Silverado Canyon. People rescued from their homes today. Extreme snow and wind shutting down parts of I-80. This is near Soda Springs, California. Chief Meteorologist Ginger Z back with us tonight, timing all of this out for us. Hey, Ginger. Hey, David, more than five feet of snow already making its way through the Sierra. There's still a bit left. Los Angeles, so parched usually, had more than two inches of rain, a daily record. But the storm is now going to turn into the Rockies and beyond. It's going to be all about wind for millions of folks. 40 to 70 mile per hour gusts from the Texas Panhandle in Colorado all the way up to the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. So watch for that, but also watch for record highs. We're talking about dozens of them, and not just daily records, but all-time December record heat possible tomorrow. When that happens, just like we saw last week, it's inevitable you get severe storms. This time, I think southern Minnesota, parts of Iowa could even see tornadoes. And then that same area hit so hard, David, could see flash flooding as this front slows down. Yeah, we know what happens when the front hits that record warmth. Ginger, thank you again tonight.